it's important as part of the Navy family that all of us in a time of crisis or a time of difficulty that uh, we reach out and help one another. This is a wonderful community, a wonderful family bonded in service, our ethos of honor, courage, and commitment, but most importantly our care for one another. Uh, the best moments that I've seen over my career have been those in times of crisis where we have all stepped up together and helped one another um, and shared those bonds that are forged in difficulty and forged at sea and, and forged in this great um, service that we are to the nation. And so for our families, um, my commitment to them and the commitment of all our leadership is that uh, uh, your welfare, safety, and taking care of you uh, is our top commitment. We are engaged uh, not only in this effort of, of authorized departures and movement to the United States of our dependents, but also standing by a very long-standing ally who has supported us for many years and helping them through a very difficult time uh, with the earthquake and the tsunami and its aftermath. Uh, our hearts go out to the people of Japan who have been such loyal friends over all these years and terrific allies. And it is a time for us to stand with them, not only to help them in this great time of national crisis, but also to uphold our regional security commitments and what we provide in terms of safety and stability uh, throughout that entire region. Um, to me, this is a, an important time uh, in our history in the Western Pacific for us to stand closely with Japan, protect our families, and continue to meet our commitments. Um, I never cease to be amazed by the extraordinary people of the United States Navy and the things that we can achieve in the face of great adversity. And, and this event as well will go down in our history of one where we rose to the challenge and excelled and uh, made ourselves stronger uh, through what we achieve here.